A battery having an EMF of 11 volts delivers 112 milliamps when connected to a 67 ohm load. Determine the internal resistance of the battery. So let's say if we have a battery right here, and it has leads here and lead here, and it goes around, connects to a resistor, and comes back, then it has some internal electromotive force or internal voltage, and then there's some resistance inside of here as well. And so you can determine the the EMF is equal to the the current times the resistance out here, which will give us which would give us delta V plus the current times the internal resistance. So I lowercase r. And then all you really have to do is solve for little r. So that give you um, the internal resistance is equal to the electrom the EMF divided by the current minus the resistance. And I got that algebraically by uh, by factoring out the the current and having r plus uh, r plus the outer resistance plus the internal resistance divided that by i so I got e over i and then I subtracted over the r to the other side. Now the only thing you have to be careful of when you're plugging in your numbers is the current is in milliamps so you want to times that by 10 to the negative 3 by, uh, to convert it to amps and then you'll be able to get your resistance so if you plug in all the numbers I have here into this equation you should get uh, that the the internal resistance is equal to 31.21429 ohms. Now's the time where I tell you thanks for watching, and I let you know that if you're watching this on YouTube, there's a link right down here in the in the about section that tells you how to get to my blog. And if you're on the blog and you want to leave me a question down at the very bottom, I usually get uh, reply to those much faster than I do to YouTube comments. Lastly, if you've been uh, taking notice, here in the last couple of, of weeks I've been leaving links to download um, Excel calculators and uh, basically what those are is it takes uh, all the formulas that you get from this video and it uh, allows you to download and plug in your numbers and give you the answer. So if you're ever in a time crunch or if you're one of the people that just fast forward to find the equation in these videos then you can just download those and uh, be on your way.